People are always saying racist things to me. It was horrible. The worst was learning about the Vietnam War in school because I'm Vietnamese. That was the worst. One time in history class, the tension was so thick, I decided to break the silence. I stood up on my desk. I was like, guys, it's okay. <laughs> we won. <laughs> Oopsie. Then I got my ass kicked. Thanks, white people. <laughs> Horrible. I got a big old Asian family down there, tons of brothers and sisters. I love them. They're great. They're very supportive. Uh, my brother is a homo. Anyone else? <laughs> you got quiet, sir. What's going on? <laughs> is that not politically correct to say anymore, homo? I think it's better than my dad's nickname for him, uh, Sticky Buns. <laughs> <laughs> my dad's really conservative. <laughs> hates gay people. But uh, true story, I never knew my brother was gay. He grew up in France. I didn't meet him until I was 13 years old. And uh, he came home for Christmas this year, guys, married to a Frenchman, which is the best thing to do if you have traditional conservative Vietnamese parents. <laughs> my dad's like, son, I can accept the fact that you homosexual, but did you have to marry a Frenchman? We Vietnamese, they conquered and occupy our territory for 200 years, and now they occupy your butt. Oh, <laughs> uh, I'm trying to have a Christmas dinner here, Dad. <laughs> Does anyone have parents like that? They'll just open their mouth and stuff will come out that you don't want to hear, you know? Uh, it's so unbearable. My mom is the worst. She is the worst. She'll just come up to me. Why are you not married yet? I'm like, oh my God, mom. She wants me to be, if you're not married in Asian culture by the time you're 25, you're considered an old mate. Isn't it horrible? So there's some Latinos in the room. You guys can, you know what I'm talking about, right? It's like 15 with Latinos, right? <laughs> Gotta be married, divorced, have three kids. <laughs> Oh.